Hey, what's up guys? This is Jeff and I'm doing my day trading recap for th Thursday 9 the 12th. So, um, in the beginning I traded like complete garbage and um, yeah, I pretty much got chopped up at the open trading in the first five minutes. So, um, yeah, I traded BHGE um, and as you can see, really terrible trading. You know, this thing sold off. Um, I took it short here on the pullback got in here hoping to break the pre-market lows here um, that didn't happen it popped up um, I got stopped out and then it started coming back down showing a little bit of weakness and um, I made the mistake of going short again so as you can see this is just uh, terrible trading I went short stopped out went short again stopped out short stopped out long stopped out and um, yeah so I traded like garbage at the open and I pretty much put myself in a nice little hole. And um, so because of this, you know, if I had waited for uh, the first five minutes, I would have seen that this was actually a long and it could have been a beautiful opening range breakup here, right? Huge hammer wick. Um, and it's clearly I was watching the one minute chart. So um, here on out, a uh, hard rule, I'm not going to trade in the first five minutes um, because, man, this thing just chopped me up. And this is the second time in the last two weeks this happened to me. So um, there's that trade. And then I traded um, dust. So um, I had dust on my on my watch uh, mainly because, um, as you, um, let me see here, let me show you. So dust is uh, short gold. Um, it's the triple uh, inverse. So three times. So as you can see, Nugget here uh, gapped up at the open. Um, and I noticed it was getting to this 50 moving average here, which I, I felt like uh, could be possible resistance. So I, I'm um, short bias and bearish on gold right now. So um, watching that, I was watching Dust and I had to take a couple stabs at this before it actually really worked out in my favor here. So on the one minute chart, I took a few stabs on this. So um, here um, I felt like, uh, you know, it, it pulled back. I tried to get in on that pullback, and, but it immediately shot back up and I got filled here. It was, it was really weird. Um, so I got filled there, here, um, hoping to get to this, um, to this level here. Um, it came back down. I didn't feel very confident, so I got stopped out. So um, that's one trade. I took another stab again here. Um, so I had, you know, I took it here with my stop right here. So a fairly tight stop. It worked in my favor. I immediately took profits here uh, once I got my two to one. So um, and then it came back down testing the 20. Um, but at this point, I didn't feel com comfortable and it was already at my break even price. So I just got all out uh, there. So um, also you can see that it was printing this possible shooting star here. So um, then I noticed it was holding the 50 moving average on the five, so I took another stab at it. Uh, let me show you here. So I added here, I added to my position here. Um, you know, it came back down, testing also the 200 moving average. It's still holding here, the uh, the 50 moving average here. So um, I added more here um, and then didn't really like the price actually, so then I stopped out. And then it popped up, I added and then I got stopped out. So at this point, you know, I'm, I'm just, you know, getting chopped up. So I, I took a nice little break and I walked away. And then I came back like 15 minutes after, and um, I noticed that the spy was selling off. But then it started to recover a little bit, and I noticed at the same time dust was coming down, which is, um, you know, coming down, and then it popped and reclaimed VWAP. So I felt like this was going to be a good entry, and at the same time. Uh, you can see that dust is on the 20 moving average and if you go to the nugget chart at the time Nugget was literally being rejected at that 50 moving average So I I took my entry literally when nugget was being rejected at the 50 moving average there So I went long Right here and I had my wrist was only five cents. So I had a you know a pretty tight stop So I was able to uh, take a bigger share size on this one with a tight stop and this one immediately worked in my favor uh, luckily, you know, I had bad trading, but this one made up more than all of those losses. So I took it long here. My stop was about five cents here. The break of VWAP. 
Um, and I held this because I, I needed to make up for all those losses. And um, yeah, sure enough, I got a huge move on this. So as you can see, um, I rolled this from uh, my entry was at 716. Um, I took profits at, at set in seven um, the 730s. Um, it's con still continuing the trend here. I took more profits. Let's see here. I took more uh, more profits. And then as it started to form this ABCD pattern, you know, um, as it started to form this ABCD pattern here uh, from yesterday, I remember I didn't add. And this one I added to my position. I saw why did I add? Because I noticed it was forming an ABCD pattern right here. ABCD. C, and this is your D, right? So I added to my position. I, I felt very confident in this trade. Also, you notice there's volume coming in here. Also, that coincides. Look at this volume on that five-minute chart. So um, I added to my position, hoping to get to, uh, hoping for it to break the uh, previous close. So uh, for a red to green move, and sure enough, it did. So I added here, added more here, and as it broke, uh, as it made the red to green move, I started taking. Uh, partials all the way up so here and then I just got all out at 70 85 here so I so I wrote a huge move on this trade um, and luckily I caught this trade because I was in a in a in a in a pretty big hole and um, this trade here put me back and um, actually taking profits today which is amazing um, so um, with those first trades, I think I was almost, I was pretty shy of max loss. So I literally had one more trade before I was going to hit that max loss. And luckily, I caught this huge move on, uh, wow, I'm um, sorry for that. I caught this huge move on shorting gold on dust. So um, yeah, lessons learned. Uh, I'm not going to trade in the first five minutes, and I'm going to make that a hard rule from here on out. Just being patient. Um, I got chopped up pretty bad at the open if i had eliminated that loss man i would have made a huge return today but um i paid for that lesson if you guys have any questions comments feel free to leave it at the bottom other than that i will see you guys tomorrow have a good one everyone